best part about my grade is that I have awesome friends and awesome teachers that I get to talk to. And Sophia. The best part about my grade is computer lab and library. to really be free and we get to do a lot of experiments. The time where I usually have the most fun is at recess. We've been friends for so long, we've never left each other. Uh, Except for when we had to sit in different spots in the classroom. It's the most horrible thing I've ever seen. <laughs> How did you guys become friends? Uh, Hanging upside down on the monkey bars and staring at each other and laughing. <laughs> The best part of being in third grade is probably everything. You they have you have more trust, nice teachers. It's really fun. My hamster's name is Bob. My dog's name is McNulty. And well, my cat's name is Sugar. What do you do for fun? Oh. Uh. Let's see. Read. Uh. Play sports. What do you think you're gonna forget about being your age? Everything. <laughs> well, I think for, they forget about being a kid and how and how hard it is for them to be in school. Sometimes your parents will say, "Do this right now," when you don't even need to do it. I think grown-ups forget that they had a lot of fun reading and playing. I don't relate to people, the kids on TV, because, like, for instance, girls, it looks like they just turn from 9 to 13. Kids that are maybe 9 years old are already wearing makeup on set. They're all, like, in this, like, life that's either totally terrible or just amazing, like, it's just fabulous. And there's none that's really in the middle. And for a world... And realistic is... You have good things in your life and you have bad things, so they don't really have that TV. None of the characters that I watch really are the same as me. I can't relate to any movies because I watch movies and either the kids are like 12 or 11 or five, 4 or 5 or in their 20s or something. It's the same thing, I don't really see people my age. I think The Little Mermaid, like, is, like, the movie, yeah. the concept is, like, horrible. horrible. Giving up your voice to be with a boy is, just is like, like, don't do that. Like, never do that. Yeah. It's like treating your life with just some guy. Yeah. Like, your voice, you can use it for a bunch of things, like, Standing up for people. Money. What? What? <laughs> what? Cut this part out. Cut this part out. Seriously? Um, um, standing up for people. Yeah. Like uh, using it up. against um, bullies. like bullies and to speak up with global warming and stuff <laughs> like that. If you have the chance to make your own movie, let's say about a Disney princess, what would you make a movie about a Disney princess? Uh, I want to make them be strong, brave, and they could help people a lot, and there's more action.